Let's have a look. Blinky, good to see you. Oh, okay. They've flown off here. So I think that the ex the exhibition match is actually going to happen here as I'm uh, talking. Right. So now when I do one, yeah, we should now be able to at least switch between the two enemies without any kind of uh, problems. This is a something like this was something that uh, wasn't properly working in the keen spectator, but the ultimate spectator actually fixes this thing. So, um, yeah, this is a big difference here. So we can still see Pilfit. He has a glorious ship here. He took on three people last week, and I think it's the same this week. Here, uh, kind of perf- Oh, he haven't got any sound. Hold on. There we go. Sorry, guys. Sound. There we go. There's the audio. It's not quite the same about the audio, right? And I believe there's one other contestant here that I'm missing. Also, if you're new to the stream, for the, the, for the actual battles, I'll hide myself as well so we get, you know, maximum- uh, Maximum cinematic stuff and there'll be no alerts no distractions nothing on screen apart from the raw battles here, so um, Yeah Another reason why I started to start uh, uh, Wanted to start early because I definitely knew it would take us a while to get everything um, Kind of prepared for that first round here. So here we go looking glorious. I might add let me just uh, go ahead and find one more character to track onto. I think there's a three-man battle here. Where's the other contestant? And that at least saves me. Is it just is it just 1v1, John, this first round? Hold on. I think it might just be 1v1, actually. Bring okay. The good news today. And then once it come in here, we can... Well, I could turn that sensitivity down. Actually, I was, supposed to t I was supposed to change my sensitivity on my controller as well so I can actually have the roll on the... There we go. Hey, Doable Snail. Thank you for uh, the subscription. I appreciate that. Welcome to the Clan Club. This isn't Clang and Twang, guys. For Doable Snail. What, a, what an awesome name there as well. Okay. Yeah, so as you can see, looking very glorious here. This is now controller work, which really uh, helps out here. And I'm actually locking on. I'm still locked on to Kansi ship. So Ultimate Spectator definitely is working better. So uh, for you guys who suffer from stream sickness, I hope I can really get the camera movement less juttery today, all right? I'm, tr I'm trying my best. I'm very conscious of it. And I will be trying to make sure we get as smooth as possible. So this really is um, a warm-up for you guys. A taster of what you can expect today. And oh my, is it looking glorious here. Bath bags are provided at the door, exactly. <laughs> And th Disperse Pixels, thank you for the cheer. Appreciate those clang cheers there. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, anyway, I'm just going to come back in here. So just explain that for the actual rounds, I'll be hidden and there'll be, no there'll be nothing on screen apart from the battles. So you guys can be fully immersed here. Um, yeah, so it's all got big quite uh, quickly because I kind of expected to go big and I was hoping to promote it with Keen, the official tournament. Um, and actually, this last week, the, the number of new applicants on the... Uh, how's, how's the audio, guys, as well? Let's, let's get the audio set as well here. How, how are we feeling on audio? Enough uh, Daka Daka? We want more Daka. Audio's nice? Good. There we go. Let's uh, switch here to uh, back to Pilfit. Oh, oh that's, that's not Pilfit. Pilfit's two. Here we go. Come down those rails. Let's come down that broadside here from Pilfit. Gotta love that Pilfit broadside. Ah, uh, it's just gotta might have to decrease the sensitivity here. The uh, sideways movement still quite, still quite high on the uh, controller here, but real gentle. Look at this! -hoo -hoo. Oh man, I'm so hyped today. It's it's one of the it's one of the best looking ships I've seen in a while. This. Uh, ship from Pilfit. Very nice. Fantastic. Here we go. Yeah, mouse and keyboards. I mean, actually, camera tracking two people is pretty easy here. I can, uh, because there's only two people to keep an eye on, but oh my goodness, it looks like Consti has been absolutely destroyed here today by Pilfit. Look at this. Looks like a piece of cheese. Goodness me. Consti still running. Got to lock on to Consti here. There we go. Consti, 
another veteran actually of these weapon core tournaments. Last year he built some of the most deadly ships. But it seems today Pilfit is just a little bit too strong for him. Look at that. Goodness me. It is but a flesh rune, exactly. All right here. But providing us with some beautiful, uh, <laughs> beautiful destruction at least. Okay, so we've got a final match, and this is a matchup between Pilfit. Oh, it's already started. It's already started apparently. Okay. Yeah. Oh my goodness. That's a lot of missiles. All right. Missile M8s away. He's got his broadside lined up there. Oh my goodness, the point defense on this gun. Now, what's interesting about this is, these are two very powerful ships, right? They're pretty max DPS. Uh, Sayori was supposed to be facing everyone in a 1v3, so both of these ships are very powerful, and I think we'll be in for quite a show here. Bellerophon. Oh my goodness me. Hold on, let me switch to... Spe And we can amplify the size of the ships, guys. The ships, the ships in these battles aren't that big, but if performance allows it, we can go, we can up the up the ant up the ante, you know? We can actually make the ship battles bigger. Who knows? We could have like freaking Veneta Veneta class kind of like size ships against one another. But we're not gonna push it for the, the first test tournament. I think for the first official tournament, we'll probably keep it similar size to keep stability. But in the future, we'll keep kind of watching the performance, watching how it goes and seeing here if we can actually make that bigger. Yeah, I use Veneta as a, as a size to kind of give you guys an idea of how, I can, how big I can imagine going, but we'll see. I wouldn't count on that. Yeah, we'll see about it. We won't, go, we won't get ahead of ourselves here, guys. The hype is real, but I'll try to not get lost in the hype. But this is some nice broadside action here. I don't know how the DPS compares to the two ships. Missiles swarm away. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness me. Those point defense weapons look sick. I'm going to come in here and try and get some... Hold on. I've lost my tracking. Let's see if we can get some broadside shots here. Expected, but a ram there from uh, Sayori. I don't know who's winning this so far. Looks like the shield's only down on Sayori. Yeah, those 203 particles are sick, right? This is Space Engineers, and honestly, <laughs> it's it's kind of crazy to think this is Space Engineers. I if I had, if you had told me like uh, you know a couple years back this would be possible, I'd be like, what? Like obviously, battles have always been a thing in Space Engineers, but battles performing at 1.0 sim speed, 60 FPS, that has not always been a thing, right? So, oh, definitely text. Big shout out to the modders. I, I will do a final show of appreciation, definitely, for everyone at the end here. Definitely give a big shout out, because there's, there's, there's a lot of people who make this possible. Yeah, looks like uh, Sayori's slowly getting melted here. Well, not quite melted. That's a bit, maybe a bit too much, but he's definitely taking more damage. His shields are down, and Pilfit is definitely, I feel like, in a, in a slightly bigger class ship, honestly. Didn't see the stats before, but... Man, the, the coolest thing is point defense, honestly. It's the coolest stuff to watch. Seeing the, uh, the point defense take out the, uh, the missiles and stuff. Coming in for a ram here, it looks like. 
Whoa, a lot of missiles. He's trying to break the shields there. You can see that. He launched a, a whole round of missiles and then tried to ram. Trying to break the shields of Pilfin. He did it? Is the shields down? I think the shields... He dropped the shields. Good job. Now let's watch these broadsides fire. Pilfin's not... Oh, sorry, guys. I just switched characters. Uh oh Wanted to watch the broadsides here. Why am I losing the tracking here? What's going on? There we go. But he's in the place he'd want to be. Look at that, that broadside from Pilfit. All his guns. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, goodness. It's definitely better to be above him than to the side of him, that's for sure. Coming in for another ram, I think. He's the only way to break those shields. Another ram inbounds. Whoa! But I think he's doing more damage to himself. Yeah, see, this is the shots I like to do, Mr. Ruman. I love to get a... I know it's not the best for the battles, guys. But I feel part of my problem is with the camera work is that I love to get, like, these cinematic shots. I love to come down here... Look at this gun. Oh, wrong shot. Hold on, my bad. I'd have to come up close, you know, get shots like this. Which isn't best for seeing what's going on, but damn, it look cool as heck. And I've also got a super low FOV. I've got a 40 FOV, so things are cinematic, but things, it's, you don't get as much on the screen. So it'd be interesting to see if I actually had uh, a higher FOV here. And look at this. What, what a, what a, what a, ah! <laughs> those shields went down in those just perfect timing for the uh, the torps there. Look at this! I can't I can't stop saying look at this, but damn, it's just non-stop violence. <laughs> oh goodness! Yeah, like I said, I'm not trying to do. Sh oh, we got a new players entered. All right. Looks like we've got new players going all crazy here. Looks like, who's this? John Wack? John Wack has entered. All right, John Wack's come to help take out Pilfit. Pilfit needs to needs more of a match here, I think. Another ram inbounds. But Pilfit's out running him. Oh, he took out one of the 250 millimeters. Yeah, the big guns turn slow, and I think the big guns turning slow is honestly what cost uh, a lot of the players tonight because the stuff of the Gladius laser systems did so much more damage. That was, that was part of the problem here today, I think. We call for reinforcements, yeah. I understand that. Yeah, I know, so... Look at this, this is just... Oh, huge! Huge hole in the side of uh, Pilfit. He is... Oh, I missed another ram, I think, yeah. But another hole, I guess. Armco, Pilfit calls for aid. <laughs> oh my goodness. I need I need I need a new vocabulary for commenting on Oh oh hello. Are we breaking the game finally? No, I think that's just something being pasted in. Probably something big. Okay. Oh, here we go. Oh, what? Is that what I think it is? All right, guys, you got you guys got a new target here. You guys have got a new freaking target. Is that what I think it is? Oh, you, you guys are killing the sim speed now, but oh my. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you guys are going to want to focus your attention on this thing. This thing is the most gun heavy thing. Oh, goodness. All on this thing, I think. Like, everything has gone to heck here. Sim speed is now taking a tank. We're, we're finding the limits of the, the matches, you know? I don't know how much... We've got uh, 18 players in the game now, so... The gun's slow turning here. All right, now we're getting more old Space Engineers battles. We're getting to that point with the sim speed, right? Wait, oh wait, what? Is it my client speed? Oh, it's my speed. It's my... Si I, I need a better PC, which I'll be actually fixing tomorrow. So it's actually... The server's fine. The server's... No way. So it's my PC. 
So if you guys have got a beastly PC, this is probably looking pretty all right. All right, okay. That's crazy. I'm trying to... Whoa, look at that broads. Oh my goodness. Poor Pilfit. Poor Pilfit. Oh my goodness. You fought valiantly, Pilfit. You were up. Yeah, the low sim speed is cinematic. It's like everything is in slow motion here. I agree. All right. Next week, guys, SimC will be better. I I'll have the new PC ready to go, so. All right, fam. I think we might have to call it there. Uh, what time is it now? Yeah, it's only 4 a.m. I oh, the Teleons coming in the side there. Look at those Teleons. Yeah, FPS. Everything is taking a tank in now. But fear not. This is not the end. This is the beginning, guys. Next Saturday, not Sunday, next Saturday, we'll be doing test tournament number three of Weapon Core. We'll be up to four players. We're going to try doing 4v4. If you're interested, jump on the Discord, ch check out the tournament channel to follow the rules. I'm not sure if everything is set in stone yet. But, um, yeah, next week... It's going to be more of the same. More of the same stuff. I'll be curious to see who enters. Will we see uh, similar teams? Will we see new teams? I'm curious. Yeah. Contain, I'm really happy to hear that. I really... That means a lot to hear that, honestly. So... We zoom out here. What is going on? They re it, re it really is all on one. Look at this, though. There's multiple battles happening here. You've got a battle happening here. The droney boys are in as well. We've got drones coming in. Oh, my goodness. Holy... I'll leave this in the background, guys. Whew. Yeah, this is not so uh, performance nice. <laughs> I'll just follow the ship around as it gets decimated, okay? This can be the background here. But it's pretty. Oh, it's pretty... Uh, a few. So, Darkstar and other Weapon Core guys, can we get the performance even more? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe it's a keen thing now. Maybe Weapon Core has reached its max. I'm not sure. Yeah, so Night Flash, you don't have to necessarily join the Discord. There is a, a spreadsheet. There's a spreadsheet we have with the rules, which is probably going around. But if you want to stay up to date with the latest rules and get involved in the conversation about the rules that we pick and suggests feedback and mods and all the rest of it. Um, my Discord, uh, we've got, there's a, there's a channel called Tournament. And in that channel, all the modders, all the organizers, all the contestants discuss the rules, give some feedback, ask, maybe look for teammates. So it's a, it's a focused place to uh, kind of, uh, yeah, get involved. But you don't necessarily have to. You can get involved externally if you, you know, have a friend or something who has the information on it. But that's my suggestion. You can check out the Discord there. It's uh, Discord.gg slash Zockley. So, there we go, guys. I'm, I'm done. I'm gone. As much as I am, I am, I am all but <laughs> out of energy. So, my back is hurt as well. Goodness, I'm so tense. Um, I'm checking the tournament channel. Any more uh, things to add from the admins here today? Or shall I wrap this party up? Well done, guys. You killed the server. Nope, it's a screenshot. Oh, it's still going. It's still going. I mean, oh no, that's why. Who put a thousand warheads? Okay, this is good. <laughs> this reminds me of the. Oh, it's almost like the Battle of Coruscant for a second there. <laughs> oh, not with Star Wars, but oh, that's why as well. Oh. Oh, it's gone. <laughs> Black screen of death. Okay. <sighs> Have you guys watched the new YouTube video? Have you also liked, commented, and subscribed? Okay. Hit that bell notification. Okay.